America's newest number one game show. Here's that lovable line all the way from Putney, England. Charlie Walters. Welcome to Aren't People Great, the game show where studio contestants come on down to reveal funny moments from their lives for the chance to win the hearts of our viewers and, of course, big, big, big prizes. Is everybody ready? And now our first contestant, all the way from sunny Altadena, let's do it for Frank Gold! <laughs> Hiya, Frank. Howdy. Give us a quickie. Well, I think America's great. In fact, I think our whole country is great. And I think it's just about time somebody stood up and said so. Look at that applause, Frank. Look at that applause. Thoroughly modern Mama-san, it's a new walk. East meets West with the Shogun 400. It stirs, fries, and steams vegetables. Fun for the whole family from Kagamusha of California. And it's all yours from Aren't People Great? You lucky man. Isn't he a lucky man? And now before Frank reveals himself to you, a word from our sponsor. Sambo's presents a big, big breakfast. Breakfast is served. Baby, your mother likes you, baby. Hello, my dear. Little angel. Back in How was your day? Baby, very nice. Thanks to God. Maybe your mother is a little sweet. We're not supposed to eat this stuff. Really, why not? It's got MSG in it. What's that? It expands the blood vessels in your brain. Well, you, you've got nothing to worry about, my boy. Nothing at all. Ah, no, you're about as funny as your show. Well, why don't you put that where the sun never shines, my boy? Remember when you sang that song on the Johnny Carson show? Johnny Carson is quite right. I'm not going to eat this. Really? Why what are you going to eat? Lettuce. Lettuce? What, what the, who put this channel on, I want to know? Who? I just wanted to see if it's as bad as it's always been. Yeah, it still sucks. Steve. Girl, a very Steve. special girl, Charlie. And she needed a few extra dollars to help out her sick father. Well, I didn't think $50,000 was a lot of money. After all, it's a big bank. Boy, was I surprised to find out her father died 10 years ago. So was my boss. <laughs> they like him. He's cute. I Look. he was going to fire me right off. So I gathered up all my courage and I walked up to his door, and I burst into his office. Well, yeah. I caught my boss and his secretary in a rather uh, compromising position. He not only did not fire me, but to keep me quiet, he gave me a raise and a promotion, too. <laughs> Did I tell you about that um, kitchen we did over at Mrs. Hallamas? I did wonders with that kitchen. I'm getting raves. I'm getting recommendations. You know, Trudy and Nick want me to do their whole house. Please welcome Chaz. We remember those uh, uh, hand-painted Spanish tiles we got in Portugal? I used them. I'm really very flattered. Are you listening? Yep, I'm all ears. I did a fight. The exhaust fan. The hood over the stove, I used them on the hood. Got the white from my tops. I got the dishwasher just a few steps from the sink. Really, I mean, it's a, you know, a real triumph. Yeah. It's really, it's really the best kitchen I've ever done. It looks great. We got the stain. Who am I talking about? Um, Rick and somebody else. Over a little bit, please, so I can
Is everybody ready? <laughs> well, I'm not. We get a word from our sponsor. Do I look normal to you? Yeah, you look fine. Well, I may look fine because I'm paid to look fine. I mean, grown men are paid to make me look fine by taking the grey streaks from my hair, and I fight in my own way to keep fit. Oh, Christ, I Kathy. I mean, I'm getting old. Oh. I'm getting widow's peaks. I've got dandruff in my hair. Well, if you take your vitamins. Look, look at my crow's feet. We're all getting old. It doesn't matter about you looking like that. It matters what? about it matters about me because I have to go on a, a TV show in front of millions. Christ's sake! I mean, the, I mean, they won't. They will not let me get grey. They won't allow me to. Christ, in ten years' time, I look like that Ronald Reagan fellow. Well, we can put you in the Hollywood House of Wax for viewing. Oh, would you be serious with me? What are you? <laughs> I am perfectly serious about this whole thing. Absolutely, deadly serious. Okay. Here's our next contestant, all the way from Cayucas, California, Sally Boswell. Okay, okay, calm down, dear, calm down. Sally, shh, shh, shh. give us a quickie. Oh, Charlie, I don't believe in quickies. When I do it, I do it slow. <laughs> that lowered upon our throne in the deep bosom of the ocean buried. But I, that am not made for sportive tricks, nor made to court an amorous looking glass, I that was sent into this world scarce half made up, and that so lamely and unfashionably, the dogs bark at me in the street. I will have the crown! Cat! Wait further off! I pluck it down! You can't be a serious actor, Charlie. Lou, for Christ's sake, I'm a performer. You're too successful in what you do now. Look, I just want to get into something more serious. I want to hey, get into something Hey, number one. Work. You've got one of the most recognizable faces in America. Who's going to believe you in a serious role? I just won't buy that. I won't buy it, Lou. For Christ's sake. Look. Look, I know the network's got some drama shows scheduled for this fall, okay? Well, I just want you to give me an audition. Now, look, Charlie. We've been friends for a long time. Now, I had a feeling that you were getting restless. Come on, look around you. See what you've got here. You're a success. A big one. You walk away from this. And you just might fall flat on your face. Just do it. Here we <laughs> Where is the place that they all love to go? It's Hollywood. <laughs> Jack and Jill, Bruce and Bill, Maddie and Mom, <laughs> Go Hollywood. Thank you, Maddie. Down the boulevard Saturday night. You 
you've never seen such a colourful sight. But make sure that you roll up your windows real tight. You like that line? Yeah. It's clever, aren't it? In Hollywood. What do you want to do? I will write more. I've got to write two more verses, and then I think I've got a smasheroo song. Oh, I do too. It reminds me of your old nightclub act. L listen, I've got something really important to tell you about. Oh, I want to. I want to.